Hi right, guys, so thank you for joining us. This is Deck 11 Cabin Tour for Balcony Cabin 154 Deck 11 on Harmony of the Seas. Today is day 7. We are headed back to Fort Lauderdale. Currently 84 degrees, 29 degrees Celsius. So a little bit different than what I do usually. Um, I'm going to go down the corridor, give you an idea of you being on the ship. One thing is the steps are color coordinated according to this map right here. Please note that you will not receive your room key when you arrive on the ship. Your set sail pass and barcode will be used for purchases. Your room key is actually waiting for you outside your cabin. That's available at 1 o'clock p.m. Which for us, it was at 101. So they were dead on. It's in an envelope that looks like this. And inside you'll have one key. And the second key will be inside your cabin. All right, so we're going to go down the corridor. Once again, this is deck 11, cabin number 154. Standard balcony cabin on Harmony of the Seas. We're using wow bands. Located, I guess, relations or Boleros when you first board. And it's only $4.95. And this is how it works. Okay, so this is how the balcony looks. So, a um, little bit of initiatives from the Quantum class. They have the his and her closets. They have the sofa in the middle. And the bed off to the side. Seen one cabin where the bed's directly in the middle. I'm not sure what the difference is when it comes to that. But um, this is actually a pretty neat setup that they have. Um, they do have this here. This controls all your lights in your room. But it uh, looks like someone beat us to the punch by putting that in. The assembly located on deck 4 is B4. It's in the theater towards the front of the ship. Conveniently for this room, um, it is located several decks under us. You do have a mirror with ambient lighting for you ladies out there. Do have a body mirror. Very useful for those formal nights. There's your thermostat. Okay, so question is plugs, 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 plugs. Well, plugs are everywhere, guys. You have two USBs, three standard plugs, a European plug. This light switch here is for your powder glass here. Once again, right here. All right, nice little seat here for you to actually do your makeup and stuff. So if you have big luggages that don't fit under the bed, here's the one closet, two large luggages side by side, if you don't have no pants or nothing that'll drape over them. If you don't have big luggages, that's fine. This right here will be a lot of convenience for your pants. This will go down. You can hang these hangers right there and put your pants attached to it. Air conditioning is different here. Um, they come out through the top vents here versus in the middle. So it's pretty good. A lot of drawer space. Hair dryer is included, ladies, as you can see. You do have your refrigerator. Highly recommend stock up on water versus going downstairs and getting them from the bar. If you have a drinking package, which highly recommended that you do, get two at a time, bring it into your room, and you're good to go. You have four drawers here. Pretty deep, actually. You fit a good bit of stuff. So 
There's a couple of empty ones. Of course, you can do luggage under your bed. Here's the other closet. A lot more hangers. I usually bring extra hangers to put my shirts so they don't get wrinkled in my luggage. Always highly recommended. I've got the safe. Pretty decent size. Got more drawer space down here, guys. Here's your bed. It is what they call a royal king bed. And more plugs. Only on this side, guys. There's only one on this side. Uh, the other side doesn't have it. You compensate for having the phone on that side. A lot of art all over the ship. Very nice TV. I'm going to give it about 32, maybe a 36. One good investment for you guys to get are these hooks, actually. I don't know. Probably Home Depot will sell them. But it's all magnetic. The whole room is a magnet versus, uh, like, the wood here isn't. But all this is, so you can hang stuff on here. You can put this in your bathroom. You can put this, actually, on the roof. Hang your stuff on there. So anywhere that has this wall or the roof is magnetic. Actually, I noticed today on the very far end, that's actually just like that wall. So you can hang stuff inside your closet too. Maybe Home Depot Lowe's will have it. All right, so since it is the inaugural season, there's a nice little book here. A lot of dedications to harming the seas from like the shipyards and elation lighting and all them. Here's all our cruise compasses. And there's a view of the room from this point. And then we'll finish off in the bathroom. Not a bad space to have, actually. Once again, we are at sea. Clean the lens off here. There we go. And you know, one cabin tour as the other one is not complete without the bathroom tour. 
One thing I can say about Harmony Disease is they have installed larger showers. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but it is a clear capsule. A lot more larger than the Oasis and the Allure. For those of you who like pressure water, their pressure for this ship is outstanding. That's what normal ships have, that's what this one has. They do include shampoo for those of you who are wondering that. They do soap as well. But no conditioner though for you ladies. Crown and Anchor members, you do have your Crown and Anchor Society robes that are included. I know that was a question on the last video. Gem and Asif robes were included. If you're a Crown and Anchor member, yes they are. They give you two. And they have it nice and folded on your sofa. One other question that someone said was, on the Harmony, are we going to have another cruise set up? Well, yes, we are. As we mentioned in Liberty, that we were going to have it, and uh, we were going to come on the Harmony. And now, we just booked Symphony of the Seas. So, we'll be June 10th, we'll be on Symphony of the Seas. So, if we don't take a cruise then, or before then, we'll see you then. Until then, you guys enjoyed the video, comment on the bottom, like on the top left, and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions. Those of you who have Facebook, use the search, hashtag LT's Cruising Podcast. You'll see pictures and 360s of the ship and videos as well. Until then, you guys cruise happy.